हेलो फ्रेंड्स एंड वेलकम टू ए के अग्रवाल एप्टीट्यूड सीरीज फ्रेंड्स इन दिस सेशन वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न ए टेक्निक फॉर सॉल्विंग ए प्रॉब्लम ऑन फैमिली रिलेशनशिप फ्रेंड्स द गिविन प्रॉब्लम इज इन ए स्मॉल फैमिली देयर आर फाइव मेंबर्स नेमली ए बी सी डी एंड ई दे आर रिलेटेड एज फॉलोज बी इज द सन ऑफ डी एंड फादर ऑफ ए सी इज मैटरनल अंकल ऑफ ए E is the mother of A. There is only one married couple. Based on this information, there may be one, two, three, or even five questions. So here, let us answer only one question: How is D related to E? Friends, if you can answer this question, you can answer any question based on the information given above. And to answer this question, first let us learn how to analyze. the information given in the problem to analyze this information let us learn how to draw a family tree to draw a family tree let us go statement wise first statement is b is son of d and father of a means there are three generation b d and a just you incorporate it here b is the son of d and father of a here it is not clear whether d is a male member or female member a is a male member or female member but b is a male member this information only you can draw from this statement okay next statement is c is maternal uncle of a c is maternal uncle of a a is here maternal uncle means his mother's brother but who is mother of a it is not clear so let us leave this space blank and c is the brother of this lady because this lady must be mother of a and her brother is c so c is a male member and this lady of course she will be the female member this is the information given by the statement 2 let us see the statement 3 e is the mother of a so e will occupy this position e is the mother of a there is only one married couple of course married couple is b plus e this is only one married couple now each and every information is incorporated in this family tree this is known as family tree here one origin this is origin 1 this is origin 2 and this is origin 3 one origin means one generation this is one generation this is one generation and this is one generation now we can answer this question how is d related to e d is here d b is the son of d so it is not clear whether d is a male member or female member so either d will be father in law or mother in law of e but because we don't know whether he is male or female so answer will be cannot be determined so it is very simple to answer any question now if how many male members are there cannot be determined because we don't know whether a is a male or female a is male or female d is male or female so similarly there may be many question based on the information given and once you are having this family tree you can answer all these questions thank you very much for watching this video friends you can also follow me on facebook